Hello and welcome to a new Malta Network Resources video. Today I'm going to the Malta Comic Art Gallery. As usual, organized by Wicked Comics. Uh, this year the Malta Comic Con isn't being held in the normal way. Instead, there is this uh, art gallery and it is going to be very interesting. It spans three days. Today is the last day. It's uh, December the 13th, uh, Republic Day. I notice we're wearing masks again outside and even inside you have to wear uh, masks. It's the only country in the uh, EU doing this. Uh, it's law, so we respect the law. So let's see where we have to enter. We have to enter from here. Yeah, there's a poster. Hello, Rex. Prosit. Welcome. To, sorry. Yeah. You are welcome. Well, let's start now with the. Uh, Sean Toki here. Okay. So there is a table which is empty. Hello. Hi, alright. How are you? Uh, no. So here we have some graphic novels. We have one which is by uh, Tim Perkins. We have also Wicked Ghost Stories of Malta, which was uh, also, you might have seen it in, in my video from the main guard in Valletta. Right, here we have t shirts, as you can see, there's also the golden lizard here being sold out. Okay, so under three uh, stuff you can you can take you can use uh, pressure drop civil war too okay these are basically small um ads or stuff you can basically here we have Roderick Watch. And by the way, the organizers, as I've said earlier, are uh, Wicked Comics, promoters of comic culture and organizers of the Malta Comic Con. So they are very good uh, organizers. People from Perth, the UK, uh, Comic Cons. We have Roderick Watch, illustrations. Let's see some of the stuff. Hello, nice. Using some Star Wars here. Yeah. 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 You can even buy them here. Yeah. Uh, you know, a very talented. Uh, Roderick, of course, he appears to be very talented from what we can see. Obviously, here there's also Stranger Things. Um, even though this year the format is different. And, and we're a bit more more of a restricted event. It's still it's still worth viewing. Okay, so let's now see what we have. Yeah, here we have Kevin Aftar. Silver filigree, he's not yeah, I think. He's not here. Here we have Christine. Let's see. Christine Mitzi is doing cosmic art. She's not here, I understand. Let's see some of her stuff. Painting on acrylics and canvas. 
jewelry also. Jewelry. These are registered with the Malta Crafts Council. If you be interested, cosmic art. Miss Freya's cosmic art. Right. Coloring books, Doctor Strange also. And the rest. And prints. You can buy these prints also. A five euro each. And you have to get in touch with the artist, of course. Yeah. I'm not seeing anything like a URL, or so here we have Eric Leone. There's another talented artist, like all the ones I've seen so far. Peter Magro, yes, right? yes. Okay, um, these are all acrylic works at the back, okay. um, uh, these are, and uh, well, those are just the prints, it's different, mm -hmm. but, but these are completely original works which have a process, mm -hmm. um, and each one of them has a different um, approach to it. So one of them is, um, uh, they're quite, one of the first ones is quite pensive, and mm -hmm. the traditionalist um, uh, fine arts mm -hmm. approach, with, uh, using just so, and, mm -hmm. uh, and, and a certain technique, which mm -hmm. places. And in this one, the last one, it's a completely original um, uh, interpretation of something um, from my own uh, take, which is a uh, battle in the middle of uh, you know, a, a snowy field, uh, using a bit of fantasy. Um, uh, and uh, the difference between them is that some of them are, they look completely different because they're also positioned in a different way. So you have stillness, and you have, for example, in this case, where you have um, uh, the explosion, which is part of the uh, dynamics, but in this case, uh, everything is dynamic. And the, the last work over there, um, uh, the last work I mean, where I'm using diagonals and choppiness and plates to allow more movement. So that's yeah. Thank you. And option. people can find your work if they want to buy something or print for example. Um, on Instagram, just on Instagram. They find, they find you as Peter Magro. Just Peter Magro. Okay, yeah. all right. Thank, thank you very, you very much. much. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll give you a card of my Thanks. YouTube. Thanks. 
see some other art oh, by being an effort I can Hello. see yeah. all right no, no okay but uh, Zin is a teacher also he's an artist he's a writer and a cool guy exactly <laughs> <laughs> and first of all um, this is good that you have clearly stated here you're on Instagram exactly and Facebook so people exactly. can find yes. you easily if they want to yes, buy yes, something yes, yes. Um, hello everyone mm -hmm. um, I'm Dean Fenech as I as you said <laughs> teacher, writer, artist. I've got my own books over here, written and drawn by me. There's Apocalypse Rock, which are, um, so it's uh, rock star superheroes in a post-apocalyptic future. And then we've got Times Are Changing, which is about three uh, Maltese characters. And each issue is uh, about their descendants in different Maltese time periods. So we've got prehistory, the Romans, We've got the Knights, uh, World War II, and the last one is the future. Okay. Okay. So then we've got... And with every 15 euros spent, you get a free print from the fire. Exactly, we've got the prints over okay. here, we've got right. original artworks over here. Okay. From the TV show. Exactly. Thank you, thank you. Next okay. minute, the widow. From the movies the as well. So all the fans of WandaVision, you're okay. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. yes, yes, yes. Fine. I try to keep them up to date. Yes, perfect. Very nice. Deadpool. Very beautiful art. Thank you. Yeah. Then all my COVID drawings that I did mm -hmm. during lockdown. Yeah, during lockdown. Mala, mala, mala. So everything to keep ourselves yeah. busy. Very good. Thank you. Gracias. Mala. Joseph Bujaya. Alright, Ashali. Alright, thank you. And then I'm doing another YouTube video this year. So I encourage people to at least know about the uh, Shahada. At least something was done. Instead of the usual Comic Con, it's Malta Comic Con. But now there is the Malta Comic Art Gallery. Today is the last day, so if you're seeing this video, probably it's now too late to come. <laughs> this year, so perhaps next year. Hope, hope Hopefully. For Hopefully. Hope Hopefully. 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 Let's get up. Mera, um, if people are interested in, in your art, they can find you on Facebook, all right? Uh, on Facebook, or Palad Joseph Bujaya. Joseph, Joseph Bujaya Art. Joseph Bujaya Art, okay. Right. Facebook, website, Facebook, Instagram. Instagram, good, good. Uh, uh, that's always important when I show something. Uh, I like to, t to tell people where they can contact uh, 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 the artist or the seller uh, uh, or uh, uh, whatever. It would be enough. I was in Amsterdam and uh, uh, there was a seller of um, food, enough, some food uh, in the market. And uh, uh, again, uh, uh, I gave the URL. Uh -huh. can visit so. hi, hi. which if they are interested in what they see in the video that we have some very nice art and you uh -huh. can see it here you can buy the prints also so you can get in touch with the Joseph from the Bodeia if it's a foreigner and they might not know our multi surname so Hello. Uh, uh, Thank welcome you. Thank you. Welcome. We have an art book here, Ben Tales, the dark origins of fairy tales. Okay. And you have, and this is the book. Yes, uh, the art book. Yeah. What I've done, 2019. Or from Malta Comic Art Gallery 2021 in the next upcoming video. See you soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe so that YouTube knows this is a great video. Thank you. Bye from Malta Resources in Birgu.